What makes a nuclear bomb so powerful? It all begins with the atom, the basic building block of matter. A nuclear bomb harnesses the energy stored in the nucleus of an atom through a process called nuclear fission. When the nucleus of a heavy atom, like uranium or plutonium, is split apart, it releases an enormous amount of energy. Inside the bomb, conventional explosives compress a core of uranium or plutonium, forcing the atoms to split. This sets off a chain reaction. Each split nucleus releases energy and more neutrons, which hit other atoms, splitting them as well. This chain reaction happens in a fraction of a second. The result? An explosion that releases immense heat, light and radiation. Atomic bombs, like the ones dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki in 1945, were based on nuclear fission. But there's also a more powerful type of bomb, the hydrogen bomb. A hydrogen bomb, or thermonuclear bomb, works by fusing atoms together, not splitting them. It uses the energy from a fission explosion to trigger nuclear fusion, the same process that powers the sun. This makes hydrogen bombs far more destructive, with yields hundreds or even thousands of times greater than fission bombs. In both cases, the blast not only causes widespread destruction, but also releases harmful radiation, which can last for years, affecting people and the environment. That's the devastating power of nuclear bombs, a technology that has reshaped history and reminds us of the incredible energy locked inside the smallest building blocks of our universe. Nuclear weapons, understanding the power, preserving peace.